It doesn't matter what addiction it is. I know some of us here are struggling with addictions. Right? It doesn't matter if you fall back into that sin a hundred times or a thousand times, as the Imam al Nawawi mentioned. Walaw al you keep repenting back to Allah Azza wa Jal. Returning back to Him, the Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, whoever commits a sin and then goes and makes wudu and then prays two raka'at, Allah will forgive his sins. Every time you fall into that addiction, do that. It's only a matter of time, my brothers and my sisters. You keep trying and trying and you're showing Allah, but the shaitan gets the better of you and then you try again. It's only a matter of time. If Allah sees that goodness in your heart, He'll give it to you. You know Ibn Taymiyyah rahmatullah alayhi mentions, whoever falls into a sin and then repents, then he has resembled his father Adam alayhi salatu wasalam. Right? So those who feel as if they're doom and gloom, there's no hope for you, brothers, I said, it doesn't matter what sin it is. Right? Even shirk billah, which is the worst sin, right? If you fall into that, the door of repentance is still open for you. Right? You have to repent from it. That's the difference.